Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are back in Stormworks, and today we are actually checking out this vehicle right here. Now this thing right here is actually called the AHS-110 Trebuchet, uh, which is actually a self-propelled howitzer, which is really, really awesome. So, we're going to take this thing, we're going to drive it pretty close to our target, and then we're going to see if we can blow up our target. So, let's drive over to where it is, and uh, see what we can do, shall we? Alright, so you guys can clearly see that I've already got this thing moving, uh, which is pretty nice. Um, one thing that's really weird about this is I'm actually, like, laid on my back. Uh, so if I open up this, let's say... Wait, why isn't that opening? Oh no, am I now just trapped in here? <laughs> I might just be trapped in here. Anyway, uh, we're driving. I'm essentially laid on my back uh, and looking downwards to look forwards. Very strange. But anyway, uh, we're going to keep going. I can barely see what's going on here, but that's fine. Uh, and we're going to destroy a warship today. Let's do this. Alright, so, uh, that marker right there is actually where the warship is. I do believe we have to get within five kilometers, uh, to actually shoot at it. So, uh, that's what I'm, I'm planning on doing. Um, I'm not sure how we get there, though. Do we turn right here? Oh, yeah. I went the wrong way. I've kind of went the wrong way. Are we going to be able to get within five kilometers on this island, though? We might be able to. Maybe. Alright, so let's say that this is fine, right? We are, uh, how far away are we? Five kilometers. Literally five kilometers. Uh, I want to know if this is going to work. So, go ahead and turn on the parking brake. There we go. Excellent. Uh, our backlight's already on. Let's turn the heater on. That seems like a fun idea. Uh, what else have we got going on in here? Infrared. We got FOV, increase, decrease. That make it easier to drive. Uh, but there you go. As you guys can see, we were laid on our back in there. It's so weird. It is so weird. Anyway, let's go ahead and jump in the back right here. This is where we fire the gun. Uh, we're going to go ahead and smack the coordinates straight into there. There we go. Uh, go ahead and turn the master arm on. Alright, there we go. Nice, that's pretty good. Backlight's on, there we go. Uh, it does have JTAC, so if you had like a row of these, you can uh, set them all together, which is pretty cool. Uh, and then we got fire and close breach. So, you grab a round, you go ahead and slap it into the gun, you go ahead and close the breach, and it is ready to fire. Is this going to work? I, I don't know. I don't know. Platform lights. Alright, fire! There we go. Alright, now it's my time to go over to here and see if it actually lands. Now, <laughs> I don't know whether it's going to. I, I really don't know, but there's the ship right there. Let's fly over to it and see what... Uh, in fact, let's sit over here. See if that round comes flying through the sky and actually hits this. I, I really don't know if it will, but uh, I guess we'll see. I guess we will see. Currently, I don't... Oh, it landed there. <laughs> that's that's a way off. That's a little bit of a way off. Interesting. All right, guys. I've moved the ship just a tiny bit. Uh, what I was thinking we would do, though... Oh, we do actually have a winch in here. That's good. Uh, oh, on the back, I guess. Yeah, that's fine. So what I figured we'd do is try and figure out how to make this thing line up um, better. <laughs> if that makes any sense at all. Um, let me uh, turn this off. There we go. Let's get back inside and see what we can do. So... What I mean by lining it up better is I want this thing to be flatter. Because at the minute, it's just not flat. And I feel like that's a problem. So, let's get down to this bit at least. There we go. Yeah, I feel like this bit's way flatter. Okay, line it up with the target, which is... I guess that way. Yeah, I, I think we're, we're pretty well lined up here. That's good. Let's go ahead and smack this back on. There we go. Get out of our seat. Jump out. Excellent. All right, close that up. Jump in the back end. Yes. Open the breach. Oh, no. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Whack that in there. Close the breach. Actually, no, 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 no. Master arm, close breach. There we go. All right. Fire. Fire? Fire. All right, there it goes. I'm going to open it up again. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, grab another one. Put it in. Close breach. And fire. There we go. And then we're going to teleport over and see if it actually hits the target. So, teleport here and let's see what happens. I'm putting myself a little bit in the firing line here, but that's fine. Okay, so there's there's the target right there. We just need to see it, like, <laughs> like flying through the sky. Uh, and then see where it lands, but I don't know how close it's going to land. we got to see it come in first before we do anything else. Oh, something just exploded. Oh, did I not change the... 
I might not have changed the thing. Okay, there's probably going to be another explosion over there. I don't see the round though, but I I, <laughs> I have a feeling there's going to be another explosion over there. Unless, unless that was the second one that exploded. Maybe. Maybe I was too late. Okay, let's go back and redo it. Yeah, I got it. I got it a little bit wrong. That's okay. Right, grab this, whack it in there, and close breach. There we go, and fire. Bam. Grab another one, put it in, and close breach, and fire. Grab another one, put it in, close breach, fire. What? Why didn't it fire? Close breach. Fire. There we go, another one. Close breach. Fire! Okay, right. I've fired off a million rounds now. I, I would believe that some of them have already hit the target. Maybe. I should have probably waited here before doing that, but whatever, it's fine. Alright, where is it? Oh! Oh, did you see that just fall out of the sky? Oh! They're falling all around us! Okay, is there more? Here's another two. I can see two more coming down. One is literally right... Oh, there you go. You can see them both. Uh, oh, okay. They're off target. Like, a little bit... Oh, that one just landed there. I think that's the last one. They are off target a little bit. I, I feel like sending this down the river a little bit and seeing if uh, it'll hit the target down there, maybe. Let's see if that works. Alright, okay. We need to change the uh, thingamabobby. Let's go ahead and whack this under there like that. There we go. Excellent. And uh, we'll start loading them in and firing them. Here we go. Close breach. And fire! Yes, another one. Close breach. Fire! Another one! Here we go. Oh, there we go. Close breach. Fire! Another one. There we go. Close breach. And... Fire. There we go. Excellent. Right, so... Let's go ahead and teleport to the shore so we can see what's going on here. And uh, we'll see if any of them hit the target. Now, the, it, it, it's not like super duper accurate. It's not like very, very extremely precise. However, it does hit somewhat close to where the target is. As you guys can see right there, they are falling out the sky. Around the target, it is... They're close! They're just not quite hitting it. <laughs> which is a little bit upsetting spaghetti, but... They are around here, which is... It's kind of cool. Maybe we should just try and hit the bridge. Honestly, let's go ahead and get rid of this. And we'll just see if we can hit the bridge. There we go. Delete that. Let's see if we can hit the bridge. Alright, bridge has been selected! Go ahead and fire! Close the breach, and... Fire! There we go, another one. Close breach. Fire! That's it. We're out of rounds. We are actually out of rounds. Okay. We're out of rounds. Uh, let's go ahead and teleport here and see if uh, either of those actually hit the target. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, God. Okay. So, as you guys can see, I've actually placed it off to the side because they didn't seem to be going as... Uh, oh, they were going too far. But this time, I think they're about to hit directly on the target. That was really close. And this one. Oh, wow. Okay, they both literally hit pretty much almost the target. That's crazy. That is actually crazy. It's cool, though. It's a very cool creation. But yeah, uh, there's not much else I can actually do with this. So let's go ahead and get inside. There we go. Let's close this up. And I guess we'll, we'll actually see what other things it has. So uh, down here, it's got this. Ready rack. Uh, manual feed override for reloading, reloading hatch. Oh, so wait, you can... Okay, cool. Uh, ammo count is currently zero. We've got a flare gun. We have a radio. We have a strobe light. We have some first aid kits. Um, this is our seat for the gunner, of course. Uh, the gunner gets in through the back end, as you guys can see right here. Um, it has this little thing right here that goes down at the ground when it's ready to fire. The detail on it is, is awesome. It looks really, really cool. Um, I actually really like it. Anyway, let's go ahead and jump up. Go ahead and get inside. And uh, I guess drive it forwards. Let's go. Here we go. We're going to drive it into the water. Yeehaw! I think I'm going to drown. Oh. <laughs> I didn't expect it to just explode when I hit the ground. But, uh, yeah, let me out, please. Oh. It's... I'm stuck. I'm actually stuck in here. All right. Well, anyway, that was really fun. Thank you guys very much for watching. If you guys want to use this thing, I'll link it down below. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.